Hi, my name is Johan Koch and I'm the product manager for Tobi Studio. Today I'm going to present some of the highlights of Tobi Studio 3.2. In Studio 3.2, we have made extensive improvements to the data analysis. First, we've added a feature that allows you to use segments as data selection in analysis. What this means is that you now easily can analyze only the portions of recording that you're interested in, such as the user task. Also, the segments can be grouped within and across recordings to aggregate data. Another improvement we made is a complete update to the visualization tool. For example, we now have instant animated visualizations on all media types. So, let's go ahead and have a look inside of Toby Studio. To illustrate the new analysis options available in Studio 3.2, I'm going to use a simple web usability study of the Amazon.com webpage with two simple tasks. In the first task, the participants are asked to buy the Brave DVD from the Amazon store. And in the second, they're asked to change their phone number in their Amazon.com profile. The setup of the study is such that the Amazon homepage will be used as the starting point for both tasks. However, rather commonly, I want to be able to analyze the data on the same page separately. Or simply put, I want to create a separate heat map for each task. To achieve this, I'm going to use the new segmentation feature included in Studio 3.2. To begin with, I have to define segments for both my tasks in all my participants' recording. In this particular case, I'm going to use the Generate feature to automatically generate my segments for all my recordings. The Generate Segment feature will automatically generate segments between specific events. And in this case, I'll use the start of my instruction stimuli as start and stop events. The next step is to assign the segments to a segment group. Actually, a segment must be assigned to a segment group in order for it to be available for analysis. So I'll assign the first task to my segment group that I'll name task 1 by DVD. And likewise, for the second task, I'll create a new group that I'll name task2, edit account. Before I show the new visualization tool, I just have to mention that the segment-based analysis is not just valuable for usability studies. It's also useful for a number of scenarios, such as shopper insight studies using Toby glasses. Here I have an example study where the participant's task is to buy snacks from a particular shelf. One common scenario is that you only want to analyze the buying behavior, i.e. from the moment they approach the shelf until they pick up the product. Before I show you more about this segmentation analysis, I just want to introduce some of the new features of the brand new visualization tool in Toby Studio 3.2. Those of you familiar with previous versions of Toby Studio can see that the UI is completely new. For example, the different visualizations are now available as tabs over here, and you can instantly switch between them. Also, the visualization tool now has a timeline with video controls that enable instant animations on all visualizations. Another great improvement is that all visualization settings can now be saved and reused across multiple projects. So here I change some and then I'll create a new setting which I'll call my new heat map, which is then available in all projects and all tests. But what about the segmentation I just did for my web usability study? The heat map that is presented now is the aggregated heat map for all my participants over both tasks for the Amazon.com homepage. But that's not the heat map I'm interested in. To create separate heat maps for each task, I have to go to the recordings and select the corresponding segment group in the segment group drop down menu. So, first I'll select the task one, and this is the heat map for task one, and then I'll check the task two, and likewise, this is the heat map for my task number two. Easy, right? This is everything I had for today. But please visit our website, toby.com, for more information about Toby Studio and other Toby products. Bye for now.